The NHS in southwest London is considering proposals to try to reduce the number of children diagnosed with autism. The clinical commissioning group say nothing's been decided yet, but the National Autistic Society has already expressed deep concern about the plans. Jane Draper has this report. Children with autism struggle to interact with the world around them. They're often diagnosed between the ages of six and nine. Services in southwest London are very stretched, and the NHS there is considering a controversial idea. A team that's supposed to carry out 750 annual assessments is actually getting 1,300 referrals a year. So NHS commissioners covering five local council areas want to reduce the number of children diagnosed with autism by focusing specifically on the most severe cases where children have another illness, such as depression. Mm -hmm. A leading autism charity is deeply concerned. We think this is short-sighted and can cause lots more problems and be more costly in the long run. And will have a massive impact on those families who just want to find out what it is they can do to help those, their children and, and what support needs to be put in place. The charity has written to the NHS in south-west London urging them to withdraw the proposal. The commissioning groups say nothing's been decided yet and they will talk to local people before deciding the way forward.